in this video I'm going to show you how to do your print and cut alignment on a Mamaki CJV. So I'm using a CJV 15075 but this is the same process for any print and cut Mamaki. So the CJV 300 or the CJV 150, 130 is exactly the same process. So in regards to the printer all I've done so far is I've put my material in so it's just a clear vinyl in here at the moment and then I have loaded all that up I've got my width on the screen there, if you can see that. I'm just going to then put my printer into remote. That will start my uh, heaters warming up, it will get everything um, going on that side. So that's all we really have to do on the printer. Obviously if you're doing any sort of cut stuff you want to make sure your cut blades are set up and your pressures are correct as well. Um, but that is really all we need to do from there. So this, this actual test is um, sent from the computer, so we do this from Rastlink itself, um, and it's a really simple one to, to get to. So I'm going to go to my computer, um, I'm going to open a print and cut file, so I've got uh, this one here, and we can click on either the cut or colour. Then what we want to do is we want to go over to our general print settings, which is just the green tab up there, and that opens up this one here. So when we've got a cut job, it will give us the option to go to cut edit, which I'm going to go to, and then going to go down to cut and print origin adjust, which is there, and that opens up this. Now this is our print and cut origin adjust. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press OK on that, and then it will start printing that out. There we go. So what you should see is you'll start to get the data come through onto the actual printer. It should come through any second. There you go, still sending it from there. You can see as well on the bottom here, it does show you that it's sending it, so it's just sending it to uh, the printer just there. So this is a really quick print and it actually looks exactly the same as what it shows you on the screen here. Um, it's going to print a load of magenta coloured boxes, um, then it's going to cut all of them out. Um, and it does it in such a way that you can uh, weed them all off at the same time to make it nice and quick to do. nearly finished. So that's finished the printing side of it. Um, now it's going to come and get the, uh, the cutter from the other side and it's going to cut it out for us. It's going to start cutting.
bit. So it's now cut the whole lot out. Now the, the thing that a lot of people do at this point which is wrong is that they will come out of remote and they'll press their local button straight away. We don't want to press that local button. What we want to do is we want to press the function one which in this case is now adjust. So pressing that will now give us these three options. We've got feed comp, PC origin offset or TP offset. I'm going to go down to PC origin offset and I'm going to go to my right key down here to confirm that. That will then automatically bring this print out into view. So it's now asking for two values. It's asking for a X value, which you can see there, and it's asking for a Y value as well. So at the moment they're both set on zero. So what we've got on here is we've got our X, which is the top line, and then we've got our Y, which is the bottom line there. So if I weed the top line off by doing this, and they all come off in one. So we're looking at what is our X value, and the X value is the top and bottom of our square. So as you can see down at, at sorry, up at 13, we've got loads of excess down at the bottom, whereas down at minus 13, we've got loads at the top. So coming into the middle at minus one, which I'd say is the best one for this, we've got a good even amount either side. So, good even amount either side, and basically, we're going to go down to minus one. So, I put minus one for that one, I'm then going to go and do the Y. And you can see now the Y is on either side, so we've done the top and bottom, we're now doing left and right. So, there you go, you can see that one is probably the best there so the most even so I'm going to go into here I'm going to put one in so I'm going to press enter on that one and I'm going to go to plus one for that one and that's done there we go